Hey Virgo, thank you for tuning in Virgos. So Virgos, what I found interesting while I was shuffling for you was I saw the King of Cups from every deck that I shuffled for you. Every single deck that I shuffled for you, I saw, I ended up with the King of Cups on the top. So, interesting, uh, I almost called you Gemini's. Virgo, some of you are dealing with a Scorpio or a water sign. All Virgo placements, take what resonates, leave the rest. Take it how it resonates with you in your situation, okay? Personal readings are in the description box. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Virgo, if this resonates with you, okay? Greatly appreciate it. Let's see what's going on with you, Virgos. Ah. That also could be just someone that loves you or someone's in love with you or hell, more than one person's in love with you, Virgo. Let's see. Whatever this is, isn't very expressive. Very soon, now very soon, they may express a little sum. Virgos. Okay, I'll take the top one, which is engagement. Bunch of other ones came out. Virgos. Okay, Virgos. Okay, getting to know each other, mm -hmm. and then chemistry is on the bottom. Okay, cool. So, Virgo, you could be meeting someone new, or something's going to the next level. We'll see. Could be with this uh, King of Cups I keep seeing for you guys. Okay, the magician, uh, Virgo. So something you've manifested. Uh, are you going to get communication from someone? The magician can also be communication. A DM, an email, uh, something along the lines of that, Virgo. You're going to hear from someone. Or again, you could be getting something that you've been wanting. Or you've been manifesting, trying to uh, bring into the 3D, Virgo. Whoever this is, Virgo, I don't know if this is you. Someone is having a hard time expressing themselves. Like, man. There we go. See, now, this came out in the same placement for Gemini. So, a song says if, Virgo, same energy. You manifesting someone and then not paying it any attention. It, and this is, it was the same card on the bottom of the deck for Gemini. Some of you may be dealing with a Gemini. Um, or another Virgo with the magician here. Um, you might be focused on something else. Virgo, or focus on yourself, focus on your finances, your home. Ooh, okay. Ooh. The Ten of Cups, the Ace of Cups, and of course I'm not going to take the other ones, but the Three of Pentacles, the Emperor, and the Eight of Swords. So we may be dealing with an Aries, but baby, Nine of Wands on the bottom. Some of you are going to get a love offer of some sort, some type of emotional fulfillment. Could be something you've been waiting on, um, Virgo, but this could also be you not being satisfied with other offers. Um, Virgo. Whoa, y'all see that? Thank you, Spirit. <laughs> yes, so that's confirmation. All right, thank you, Spirit. So, yeah, Virgos, either you or your person isn't satisfied with other offers. So, if someone was like entertaining others Virgo like you separated from someone and they were entertaining others they don't want anyone else wherever this is Virgo does not want anyone else period 
They've tried. Six of Wands. Yes. Uh, you're going to get exactly what you want. You have a victory of some sort, Virgo. What you've been wanting, you're going to get from out of this connection. And again, you could have been visualizing this. Yep, Six of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. I feel like it's like mutual. Like The thing about this, though, Virgo, I feel like both of you guys act like you don't care when you do. And I kind of, y'all, y'all need to stop that. But again, I, I kind of get too with this vibe of this person not wanting anyone else. Uh, Virgo, you have two sixes next to each other. Ooh, the sun and the moon's on the bottom. So you're dealing with a divine counterpart. Wow, Virgo. Whoever this is realizes that you're their person. Whoever this is 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 set. They are sure that you are their person. And again, this person may have like tried to play the field. This person may have tried to date other people, but they they don't want anyone else but you, Virgo. You're all they want. They want no one. They don't they don't want anyone else, Virgo. I'm seeing emotional fulfillment. I'm seeing happiness. This person sees a, a happy family with you. They want to have this happy family dynamic with you. They see like you're this person's end all be all, Virgo, in a nutshell. They also may want children too, uh, Virgo. This person wants children with you. Take that high resonance. Yeah, page of, uh, page of Cups, yeah. And the Seven of Cups. See, I feel like this person tried to find the chariots on the bottom. This person may have tried to replace you. And I don't want to say replace you because I feel like you two may have broken up. I'm not saying that this person dumped you to go and explore options. Now, it, it's going to be different for why you guys broke up or why you guys separated, if you're even separated, because some of you have already reconciled with this person. But I feel like, um, but this could also be, again, Virgo, if you're still dealing with this person, this person doesn't want anyone else. They may have other offers. They may have people from their past coming towards them with offers and things like that. Um, this person doesn't want anyone else. And for others of you, if you've separated from this person for a little bit, I feel like they may have, you know, dated and, and tried to see what else was, was out there. And it's like nothing, nothing compares to you, Virgo. Nothing, nothing or no one else compares to you. They only want you. They they see this happiness dynamic with you. They don't see the happy family with anyone else, Virgo. And they and I feel like some for some of you they've tried. You may have tried to see other people, but it's it's just like everything go goes back to you, Virgo. But I feel like this person is just gonna let that be known to you. Yep, 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 what I tell you. <laughs> the full, mm -hmm, a new beginning, a new start, which is what I've been kind of seeing um, for the for the signs and stuff. A uh, new start with the new year. The Hierophant, yeah, ooh, some of y'all, mm, some of y'all getting a marriage proposal. Yep, Seven of Cups, C. The High Priestess, mm-hmm, I saw that earlier. And the Chariot. Uh, I'm seeing lots of sevens. Some of you might be seeing seven, seven, seven. I'm seeing a lot of sevens. I'm also seeing a lot of sixes. Five of wands on the bottom, uh, Virgo. Yeah, this person tried to see other people and didn't work. In a nutshell. It's every everything brings them back to you. I also feel like too, uh, Virgo, this person might be trying to find out if you're seeing someone else. If you're um, dealing with anyone else. You have the seven of cups here twice. For me, with the Seven of Cups next to the Hierophant, it's, it's kind of, it, I get the vibe of like a surprise proposal for, for some of you. Because mm, some of you are going to be surprised by what this person does next, Virgo. Because you may be dealing with someone that kind of may have even told you that, oh, the chariot's here twice too. Yep, could be a Cancer. See, Cancer, Virgo, um, 
Pisces, Leo, Gemini, Virgo, like you, Aries. Yeah, um, Virgo, I feel like you're going to be surprised by this person's actions because I feel like this person knows that they're not going to find, they're not going to find another you, Virgo. They're just not, they're not going to find another you. And I feel like you're going to be kind of shocked. This person might be planning something um, in secret, a proposal or of some sort, some type of love gesture for you, uh, Virgo. And you're going to be surprised by what this person comes up with. Because I feel like it's it's out of this person's comfort zone. It's, it's, it's different from what uh, this person is used to, or you're, you're used to seeing from this person. Um, Virgo, Pray For Me by Anthony Hamilton shows up. This song is literally about someone, you know, trying to play the field and, and finding out that, you know, they were stupid for doing so. So, I'm jealous I want you to myself. Yeah, I feel like, like I said, uh, Virgo, this person might be trying to find out if you're uh, dealing with other people like they don't they don't like that at all i'm about to call didn't i say they're about to reach out to you if you're not talking to this person they're about to reach out i'm about to call slash text you i told you mm -hmm. these feelings i have for you are like no other it scares me yeah i feel like this person may have you know got scared i want to write a song for you oh see i did say this person would like give you something or no that was a gemini reading yeah, but I, I do still feel like there's going to be like some some level of surprise, some like really great gesture this person does. For some of you, it's a proposal. Now, I know that's not going to resonate with everyone. It's a surprise uh, supro proposal, Virgo. Manifest from the heart. For others of you, it's something else. It's not going to be a proposal for all of you guys. I just wasn't ready for you. Mm -hmm. They may have played games. That's the vibe I get. I feel like you're out of my league and I don't deserve you. Yeah, for a lot of you, this person did some bullshit. Mm -hmm. I told you they tried to replace you. I can't handle thinking of you with someone else. I told you, Virgos. I told you. What I tell you? Because they already know they're not gonna find another. Vir they're not gonna find another you, Virgo. Period. We spent lifetimes together. Some of you are dealing with a Gemini. Hurting you only hurt myself. Mm hmm. Yep. Your lips look so kissable. All right, Virgo, that's y'all's reading. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace out.